What is up, you guys? Welcome back to your girl's channel. Too close, too close. Today, you guys, we got Lionel Messi versus Physics. Let's get straight to it. Oh, I pronounced his name right. <laughs> um, like I said, I grew up wanting to play soccer. Play soccer my whole life, you guys. I stopped at like maybe age 13. I think 13 or 12. I don't know, but I was a beast, y'all. I was a beast. So we're gonna get straight to the Lionel Messi. He be coming in. He be coming in. He he is one of the kings. I ain't gonna say because we all got our own opinions, but he is one of the kings when it comes to soccer, y'all. So hey, we're gonna check out the footworks and he is versus someone. So hey, show Lionel Messi some love. And hey, if y'all fuck with physics, let let me know. Putting all the planets into consideration before he detonates this one. It's the calculus of a goal solved in a nanosecond. Messi! Beats the laws of physics. He knows the laws of physics, but they don't know him. That's where he lives. He lives in the magnetic spectrum of genius. And it cut. It went over all of them, y'all. I don't know if y'all caught that, but it went over Beats all of them. Beats the laws of physics. Why? He knows the laws of physics, but they Wait. don't know him. That's where he lives. This one. He lives in the magnetic spectrum of genius. And it confuses Einstein. It doesn't cut. Use Leo Messi. I tell you what, if Isaac Newton was watching this man, he'd be saying, "Boy, was I wrong." This is what Einstein called a spooky action over Cut distance. Through. That's what he was on about. Amazing! This should near the constellation in the heavens after Lionel Messi. So Isaac Does Newton, miss? from up above, looks down. Oh hell no! Nah. That's a punch. Why he grab him? Like that? in the heavens. After the Messi, Sir Isaac Newton from up above looks down and says about that gravity thing, I was wrong. Damn, he literally fighting for the ball. From up above looks down and says about that gravity thing, I was wrong. Messi was right. He teases gravity. This balance is astonishing. His feet are taken, applies the brakes, gets on the other side of the defender. It's amazing. Look at his balance. Better balance than a winner. On a they are literally trying to fight, dude. So he won't get the ball because they know he's an animal. <laughs> what are you talking about? They all literally grabbing him. Amazing. Look at his balance. Better balance than a winner on a very rocky cruise ship. He steers upright. This man is still going. You can't knock him over. Got knocked down. He got straight back up again. It was a good 10 seconds of messy magic. I'm sure there's a magnet in that. Well, look at the strike, Kevin, to hold off the chance. And then running at the four defenders inside. Picks the spot. Oh, hard do you stop this little man. One of the rare breed as well who's as quick with the ball as he is without it. Look at that for a run. The center of gravity, ability just to go and defend us at pace, keep that ball more or less tight to your foot, it's just absolutely astounding. It's not the statistics, it's not the statistics! You don't measure that by statistics, it's immeasurable. When you see this run again, Phil Shane, and your statistics, you tell me, how do you measure somebody that could balance a balloon Joking. in a wind tunnel on a needle? Because Messi is capable of that. It's Messi. Kala trying to rugby tackle him, but he's on the ground and Messi's still running. He is so nimble and so strong as well. Great balance. Now Messi leaves the defender on the floor. And the okay. No embarrassing. Yeah. He's not no foul. Oh, Messi has ever so well on the ground. <laughs> There's no space. There's no time. And that means nothing to Messi. Einstein looking down. See, I have to have a talk with this guy. He knows something I don't know. Amazing from Messi. Looking for Messi. Cuts back to his right. Tucks it around. And makes if most of these soccer players wasn't wearing cleats, like their cleats wasn't tied up, man, Lionel will definitely knock them socks off. And not, but he would definitely juke the hell out of him. As constant as a northern star and twice as radioactive. Absolutely genius again when we look at it again. The trajectory Bro. is perfect. The spin, the dynamics, beautiful. Messi, summarizing stuff. Messi, in his own time, taking on all comers again. And is there any room? If there isn't any, he'll find it more often than not. So tight, congested, think he can't get through. It's impossible. We watch him do this weekend, week out. Look at that. 
and then he slots it underneath the goalkeeper. It's just Gaff. unbelievable football. He reels his way through. There's no time or space here for Messi. Imagination in 3D. He sees all of his angles, he sees all of the options, and he says, I see you lads, I don't need you. Touch from Messi. Close control was mesmerizing. Oh, he's been just finding little pockets all evening. He's just such a hard player to man mark. And all he needs, a man of his quality, is half a yard because how he pulls the trigger with hardly any backlift, I'll never know. It's such magical work from him. Messi wiggles away from two. Cuts it back to Messi. Let's see, trying to get away. I mean, he's just going through like five to six people at a time. And if he loses the ball, he going back to get From Fontas and succeeding, astonishing from Messi. The guy's a magician. I mean, the, the size of him. He shouldn't be doing what he's doing, really. Lionel Messi scaling the heights. Absolutely stunning here, Dom. He's only five feet seven. Into the middle, the header! And Messi does it again. Messi's header. Messi's goal. Hey, he said he ain't got the strength, the power in his neck muscles to get that. It's just staggering. Stands five foot four. Look at Jumps that. six foot four. Oh, it's a fabulous header. Anybody would be proud of that in a number nine chair. He's number ten. Messi. Smallest guy on the pitch, and he still wins the ball. And he picks it over Cristiano Ronaldo, who is tremendous with his vertical leaping. And you, real. Yeah, he's <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Even when you yeah. get tight around him, he finds a way to get through. He's that good. He sees this type of stuff clear. Other players, it goes hazy, and they don't see it clear. He does. I, I just feel that he, in his own eyes and his own vision, yeah. the game just slows down for him. Yeah. He That's plays three in slow people right there. It, it comes to him so easy and so naturally. He slows everything down in his mind, and he's able to make decisions that end up in goals, and does it weekend <laughs> after weekend. He does things that nobody has ever seen before. He does things that nobody understands how he produces them. You know, he sees things. He put in that work. What are you talking about? Day in and day out, he put in that work. Practice makes perfect and messy now, perfect. We don't see it. I wouldn't even consider one if it's possible and even attempting it. You sit here, I was looking in the stands at times and looking at people looking at that, looking to the sky and saying, how is he doing that? And, and what is actually crazy, it, you guys have to understand that, he's virtually on the same step, he's coming back on his right foot. And now that, that, that it's not logical, because if I try to do that, obviously it's, just, it's kind of smaller. If I try to do that, you'll fall. Sometimes you've just got to say he was too good. Two against four, but one of them is messy. Gets around. Mirales tucks it in! Get it in by Di Maria! A masterpiece from Messi! He actually puts negative spin on the ball! Look at this ball! We talk about mutant flies eye vision and we don't see it! The genius of the pass is that it gave him time where there was no time ahead of it. He's got two balls to pick out and he goes for the impossible pass. Well, impossible is nothing for Lionel Messi. He's seen passes I don't, I don't even see. Extraordinary, almost extraterrestrial. Messi, close control, extraordinary in the balance and the strength. It's still Messi. Messi, first touch from him. <laughs> it doesn't seem to matter what the conditions are like for Messi. He's taking advantage of the ball breaking there. It's absolutely unbelievable. Even in a pond of water in the middle of the pitch, Leo Messi capable of getting away from three or four opponents. Incredible. That's for what here's Messi. Messi gets away oh, into the space, even though the pitch is holding up. Messi keeps going. Mind you, such a footballer, even though Messi walks on water, doesn't he? <laughs> Messi being shattered by Mark Rocca. Messi turning on. He's just got superhuman powers. He can Come do on. things that no other go. footballer has ever been able to do. And he makes it look so simple. Measured by records, but this is beyond measurement. Look at them converge on him. Four players, like metal failings to a magnet, and he leaves them. We are watching a master at the peak of his career. Who knows what legacy he will leave this fabulous game because he is setting new standards. Hey. 
Lionel said when he Lionel said when he play, he gonna make you sweat. He gonna make you sway, he gonna leave you in the dust, he gonna break the ankles. I mean, hey, this was footwork on top of footwork. You literally have to double team him and he's still gonna pass you. <laughs> and one thing I do like about Lionel, like he's not a ball cog. Although he knows he's most likely the best on his team, hey, he's still not a ball hog. He still works as a team and that makes him more lit. Yeah, he has some nice ass footwork, y'all. <laughs> Embarrassing the whole team, y'all. Y'all let me know how y'all feel about Lionel Messi down in the comments and uh, yeah, let me know why y'all call it uh, football. I understand all the gravity stuff, but soccer, y'all be calling football. Comment down below because I'm confused about that. Your homegirl confused about that, but let your homegirl know if you guys want me to do more Lionel Messi um, reactions and your girl gonna get to them. Let's go.